do you find yourself a little bit more um i don't can, can, do you find your focus that you don't have to look for a contract like i know guys sometimes come in here and they're more concerned about the contract rather than training and getting better is it nice just to be like oh i can breathe drake you can work on your game work on yourself is that must be a nice feeling yeah no i think it can go both ways like some guys i feel like if you get a long deal you kind of take a step back where you know i look at guys like who we skate with sid and nate uh, Brad, they've all been on long deals, but they're the most hungry guys. So, you know, for me getting that long contract, yeah, it's nice. Obviously, I don't have to worry about a deal for, for six years, but, you know, it's, I'm still hungry to get better. And, uh, you know, it's cool. Obviously, obviously set up nice financially with the long, long-term deal. But, uh, yeah, it doesn't really change my mindset or anything. I just want to get better every day. I think that's the difference between you and just well, professional athletes in general that have long careers and not so much. It's, like, I'll admit, like – get an you know get an advertisement deal like i'll breathe I'm like thank god you know go to the mall maybe and yeah but like it's sure. just but like that amount of money like just still be hungry it's, it's there's got to be something else in you you know yeah. i think just like uh just winning's everything man like everything comes with winning if you win more guys get paid like it's just the way it is right so that's why the good teams can never stay together because once you win go into free agency everyone's getting the money they they are asking for because they won so winning helps everyone out financially and just just winning's the best in general <laughs> i bet it is yeah i bet it is yeah. have you learned a lot about the business side of hockey over these years as being a professional hockey player yeah i think so man. i think so for sure um definitely learn learning more every year i, I like i sit at the back of the plane i don't really i don't play cards just because the boys play for an arm and a leg but uh <laughs> I play, I sit in the back with the older guys and uh, you learn a lot from them. Just you know, I bought a, I bought a two houses now, one in Ottawa, one here. Learning how to deal with that, just just everyday things, you know. As a as a young guy, you got to deal with. So just learning all the time. Do you have any tenants? I I do. Yeah, I got someone mowing mowing the grass here. I got a big old lawn, so I didn't feel like buying a John Deere this summer. But next summer, I think I'll get a ride on and. Uh, start doing it myself oh yeah for sure yeah. two homes wow where do you but yeah. you're gonna spend most of your summers here yeah i'll always come back here yeah my training everything's back here all my buddies still live here so halifax halifax is home halifax in the valley so buzz back and forth it's such a great place to live yeah i love it like i, I love going back to the valley you know i've been been away now for almost almost 10 years go back everything's the same you know we got a new starbucks in the, in the superstar <laughs> that, that's a, that's about it man yeah. is that from there the starbucks no no i grabbed that one just down the road but yeah i went went in the superstore a couple of weeks ago and saw a starbucks in there and asked the parents like yeah we just got that about a month ago and it was a big hit in town for about a week and then you know people got sick and tired of paying six bucks for a coffee and it's pretty slow now <laughs> Yeah. they go to starbucks <laughs> yeah that's that's the big news in the valley you get a starbucks in the superstore but yeah starbucks and a new burrito spot so what's the burrito spot habaneros no i'm, I'm not sure the name it's a, it's a different spot but i haven't tried it out yet so we got two new things in the last 10 years in the valley we're we're getting somewhere <laughs> you don't need anything you guys are great the way it is no i love you got it, ken Wo, you got the the winery yeah you got eagle crest you got some great restaurants acadia is there oh yeah not much more you need in the valley you don't want too much you no gotta, I you don't. gotta keep it the way it is yeah i like it old school man anyway so no it's it's great i love it back home but i love it here too yeah 100 percent. yeah